All right, I want to show you something that's a really fun way to create shapes in Cinema 4D. So what you do here is you go here to this particular tool. This is the spline tool up here. And I'm going to pick one. Let's say, for example, I'll pick uh, the helix. And it makes a simple little sketch for you, okay? Now, what you're going to use is a generator, right? We're going to go to this generator tool, and you're going to click and you go to the one called lathe. Now, when I let go, look what happens. I have two objects here in my little object manager. I've got the lathe and the helix. Now, what I need to do is make the helix the child of the lathe. So what I do is I click on the helix, push it up, and let go, and boom, there it is. Now, if we spin around, you'll see what's happened here is I've created this object instantly, right? Just from actually working uh, with this particular tool. Now look at all these things I can change here. I can push on these little levers here and do all sorts of adjustments to this. It gets to be really <laughs> just wild and wacky and amazing um, what you can do. Uh, you can spend hours literally playing with this. Now, so that's just one, right? That's just the helix. Um, let me delete that. Now let's try another one here. For example, here's one called flower. And again, it creates the basic shape. Then you go to the generator, and I'm going to go to lathe, and I'm going to drag the flower up into the lathe to make it the child of the lathe, and there it is. And again, I can start to change things in these tools here and you can see all the possibilities. It's just really, really fun to experiment with. Now, there's a way to do it in a custom way as well, which you should know. And it's hard to do it in the 3D view like this. So what I'm going to do is click right here so I can see all four different possible views. And I'm going to go to the front view. And I'm going to do this within the front view. And I'm going to go up here to a tool called Sketch. Now, this is the spline sketch tool allows you to draw something freehand. So for example, let's say I want to make something like kind of like a, like a pot or something. I'm going to make a like a little base. All I have to do is draw the right side, right? That's all I have to do. Draw the right side. And see it says spline. So I've created a spline. Now then what I do is I take my generator and I go to lathe and I'm going to push it up to become the child of the lathe. And there it is. Now you can't really see it too well in the front view, so I'm going to go back here and take a look here at the 3D view here. And look, there it is. I made this pot basically by hand, you could say, right, by experimenting with this uh, with this lathe tool. So that's a way to customize and make your own shapes using spline drawing, but you can also use some of the prefab shapes as well that are in the spline tools that are available. Lots of fun.